معايا واحد على التليفون من اساطير الكره الانجليزيه ومن اساطير نادي نيوكاسل يونايتد الانجليزي مستر لي كلارك مستر لي كلارك هاو ار يو الو يس جود ايفنينج جود ايفنينج يس اي كان هير فيري جود اي هوب يو ار دوينج فاين ويلكم اون الاهلي تي في ثانك يو يا ديلايتد تو بي هير يا ثانك يو سو ماتش ذا بليجر از مايند سو Uh, I want to ask you about uh, first why do you think England lost against Croatia and the dream about its coming home its end Yes the dream it's coming home yes it has ended but um I think our, our national team has done us proud uh we're a very young team at the moment we didn't expect um us to get this far Um, so in the competition to get to the semi-final, but uh, we're, we're, we're delighted with with how the team played. Obviously in the semi-final, I think uh, we had a great first half, but from the second half and an extra time, Croatia were just too strong. We couldn't get the ball off them. Uh, Rakitic, Modric, uh, Perisic, um, Mandzukic, uh, all world-class players. And uh, we we just we just found it difficult. Uh, I will translate to the people, and I'll be back to you with the second question. Uh, سألت في البداية على رأيه في uh, مستوى منتخب الإنجليزي وليه منتخب إنجلترا ما قدرش يصعد ليه المباراة النهائية ويحقق الحلم اللي كان كل جمهور إنجلترا مستني. قال لي إحنا عندنا العيبة الصغيرة في السن ممكن ما يكونش عندها الخبرة الكافية أيضا. منتخب كرواتيا كان منتخب قوي جدا وقال اسامي طبعا راكيتيتش ومودريتش وبيرزيتش ومانزوكيتش كانوا كفايه ان منتخب كرواتيا يحقق الفوز ويصعد للمباراه النهائيه مستر كلارك اولسو تومورو ذا جيم بتوين انجلاند اند بلجيوم ذير واز ذا جيم بيفور ان ذا جروب ستيج بات اولسو انجلاند لوست اجينست بلجيوم 1 0 I think it's different now it's different we have a medal you will play to fight to have a medal So I think England will be uh, more more motivated than Belgium. Uh, Southgate uh, has the passion to uh, to uh, to has this medal and to be the third uh, place in the World Cup and to do something for himself and for the players. Yeah, I agree. We we played in the group. Uh, both teams made lots of changes. Uh, it wasn't our first eleven players out on the pitch, but uh, you know tomorrow is. an opportunity um, for the players. I think Southgate will pick players who maybe have not played much in the in the World Cup to give them the experience uh, to look forward to the future. Mm. And uh, But as you say, to win a medal, to get the bronze medal in the World Cup after what's been uh, a difficult few years for the England national team could be a great uh, possibility for them. So... We all look forward to the game tomorrow to 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 try and win it and uh, progress and give give the nation uh, lots of uh, hope going into uh, further competitions. Yes, I asked you about the view of the match tomorrow against the Belgian team and the third and fourth match. Southgate has a bigger player than the Belgian team. He is the captain of the Belgian team and the captain of the Belgian team. عايز يحقق حاجه لنفسه حاجه للمنتخب واللعيبه الصغيره دي تحقق حاجه في اول مشوار او اول تجربه دوليه ليها قال لي طبعا اكيد هي مباراه تكون قويه طبعا الموضوع مختلف ما بين مرحله المجموعات عن المباراه الحاليه ممكن يبقى في دفع لبعض اللعيبه اللي ما شاركتش في مشوار كاس العالم لكنه في الاخر اكيد بتمنى التوفيق للمنتخب الانجليزي اولسو مستر مستر كلارك I want to ask you about the Sunday match between Croatia and France. Who do you expect to win the final and uh, who will be the better side? We know that France is a good team, has a very good uh, uh, players, but Croatia played three games in a row, 120 minutes. So, who do you think? I think, uh, I think uh, two terrific teams, two excellent uh, teams with lots of very very good individual players um it will be very tight i think the midfield area will um be the where the game is won and lost um obviously Pogba 
in, in there for France, Modric, Rakitic in there for Croatia. It's who dominates those areas. We have to um, see see what happens. I'm looking forward to the game. I think it'll be exciting. I think there'll be lots of good players on view and, and, and um, you know, hopefully the best team who produces the best football will win the game. And what about the overload uh, of Croatia? Three games in a row, they played 120 minutes. No. It I can be affected the players of Croatia? No, no, I think everyone in England was talking about this as being a possibility for England to win the game. This wasn't the case. Croatia in the second half were very strong, yes. looked very fit, looked very physical. So I don't believe this will be an issue. Mm. I think it's the World Cup final and uh, everyone wants to play in these games and this will this will not be an issue uh, come Sunday. Mm. Uh, سألت على رأيه في المباراة النهائية ما بين فرنسا وكرواتيا يعني كان متفق معي في موضوع نص الملعب قال نص الملعب مع عندهم كل منتخب يمتلك نص ملعب أفضل من المنتخب الآخر وبالتالي نص الملعب هو اللي هيفصل ويحكم في المباراة ذكر على سبيل المثال بوجبا وكانتي في نص الملعب في منتخب كرواتيا ذكر مودريتش وراكيتيتش وبالتالي هتبقى مباراة قوية جدا سألته على الإجهاد هل هو هيأثر على منتخب كرواتيا لعب ثلاث مباريات على التوالي 120 دقيقة قال لي ما أعتقدش هم عندهم لياقة بدنية عالية جدا شفنا في في ماتش المنتخب الإنجليزي لما نزل الشوط الثاني كانوا أقوياء أقوى من الشوط الأول وبالتالي دي نهاية كأس عالم وبالتالي ما فيش حاجة تأثر على الفرقتين. Mr. Clark, I will take you to the English Premier League about Mohamed Salah. You know that he was the top scorer of the English Premier League last season. He was the best player. A lot of things happened with Mo Salah in Liverpool. Do you expect from Mo Salah this season to be similar like the last season or maybe he has less chances than the last season? No, listen. Um, Mo Salah was a fantastic player in England last season. We expect to see him next season. Uh, everyone in England, uh, whether you were a Liverpool fan or not, we love to watch Mo Salah. Fantastic goals, yes. uh, creates his own goals. Um, a very, very talented, magical player. Uh, Mo Salah is a, is a big uh, football player in England and uh, we love to watch him. So. This season, we expect uh, the, the same as, a, as he produced last season. Do you think with the signing that uh, Liverpool is doing now, that Liverpool will be, uh, for an example, a good opponent to the to Manchester City and Manchester United and the top clubs and can win the English Premier League? Or still, Liverpool doesn't have the good quality players that can win the title of the English Premier League? No, no, Liverpool can win the English Premier League without a doubt. We believe uh, in this country that Liverpool have one of the best squads in, in, in the league and they can challenge uh, Manchester City, mm. also Manchester United and Chelsea to the challenge and Tottenham Hotspur to challenge for to win the league. So, no, we, we, Mo Salah and, and, and his teammates, we believe, can can do do the very good things. Yes, Mr. Clark, thank you so much for your time and of course good luck for England tomorrow against Belgium. Thank you so much. كان معانا لي كلارك النجم الكرة الإنجليزية ونجم نادي نيوكاسل الإنجليزي وآخر سؤال كنت سألته على محمد صلاح وحقق موسم رائع جدا الموسم الماضي هل تتوقع تألق محمد صلاح الموسم الحالي ولا فرصه أقل؟ قال لي محمد صلاح كلمة مهمة جدا 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 قال لي لو بتشجع ليفربول أو لا احنا كلنا بنحب محمد صلاح كلنا بتحب نتفرج عليه قدم موسم رائع جدا واحنا مستنيين انه آه يكون ان شاء الله الموسم اللي جاي آه بيأدي بنفس المستوى احسن كمان سألته على فرص ليفربول في المنافسة على اللقب بعد التعاقدات اللي تعاقدوها آه مع بعض اللاعبين في الموسم او الفترة الحالية هل هم قادرين على على المنافسه على اللقب ولا لا؟ قال لي طبعا ليفربول يقدروا ينافسوا على اللقب وواحد من الانديه اللي عندها لعيبه على اعلى مستوى وكمان بزود لكلامه انه عنده مدرب محترم ومدير فني بيعرف دايما يطلع احسن حاجه موجوده في اللاعبين.